Thank North you. Dakota Senator Heidi Heitkamp is apologizing for a campaign ad that publicly identified sexual assault survivors without their permission and wrongly named others. The Democrat facing a tough reelection fight ran the newspaper ad while trying to explain to voters why she opposed Justice Brett Kavanaugh's confirmation. Ed O'Keefe is on Capitol Hill. Ed, good morning. Good morning, John. At least 22 of the women say they didn't give their consent to be involved in this, and they're th threatening legal action, saying that Heitkamp's campaign may have actually violated state privacy laws. The ad ran in some North Dakota newspapers over the weekend. It, had, it was addressed as an open letter to Heitkamp's Republican opponent, Kevin Kramer. It read, we're here to let you know that we have all suffered from domestic violence, sexual assault, or rape, and that, yes, we expect somebody to believe us when we say it. In a statement, the women said Heitkamp's political agenda has interfered with or downright ruined our lives. In some cases, the women said they had to reassure family they've never been assaulted or raped. For her part, Heitkamp is deeply apologetic. CBS News obtained one of the voicemails she left for a wrongly identified woman. Take a listen. Hi, this is Heidi Heitkamp. I don't know if you want to talk to me or not, but I wanted to extend a personal apology and... and just want to spend um, just a few minutes uh, just talking to you. I'm so mortified and horrified, and I can completely appreciate if you don't want to hear from me. Now, Heitkamp is one of those 10 Democratic senators running for re-election this year in a red state, and right now she's seen it most at risk because polling suggests she's trailing Kramer. John? Ed O'Keefe, thank you, Ed.